wealth, fame, power. The King of the Pirates attained this and everything else the world had to offer, and his dying words drove countless souls to the sea. You want my treasure? You can have it. I left everything I gathered together in one place. You just have to find it. My name is Ingus, and I'm going to become King of the Pirates. Alright lads, so we have just used about 500 knives. This is all we have left. Just camping moss giants for a little bit. And this is the loot. Uh, we have just found a way to get GP. Oh, not good, man. Not good. I don't think I have enough GP to survive this. This may be the end. As soon as I log in, I'm going to get take a 11 damage of poison. I don't think I'm going to survive this. Yeah. Oh, there's only one way you can find out. Okay, these herrings sell for 30. Okay. This might be possible. Guess I'm just gonna have to wait it out. Look at that, dude. I had no idea they hit so hard. I don't know what to do if I can't stall it out long enough. There we go. Alright, it's going down. <sighs> that was terrifying. <laughs> Like, my heart's racing so fast right now. Man, I'm so lucky that I bought... That I have some food right now. And I almost just misclicked that pirate on the last world. <laughs> this is not looking good. Alright, it's nine, da nine damage now. Oh. That was so close. I wish I was recording, you could have saw like, as soon as that I saw that I was poisoned, I was like, oh, no, no big deal. And then it hits me for 11 and I have no food. I am so lucky that I found this dude. There is an anti-poison at the general shop, like a bit south of here, but I don't think I'll be able to make it at this point. Not with this food, I have no run energy. If I had been really quick about it, I probably could have made it there, but it would have been super clutch. Man, <laughs> I'm like shaking right now. That would, that is not the way I wanted to go out on this game. I was literally like 6 HP. Oh, so freaking close. We're gonna burn through all our GP probably, but that is all right. We will live to see another day. I'm gonna go over to the bananas just in case. I suppose I can go to the bank actually. That was, that was a close one. Wow, I didn't even see these two wines in my inventory down here. That's how much I just panicked right there. So I just sold all that stuff from the Moss Giants and we just got ourselves 3k coins. Druidic Ritual complete. And Restless Ghost complete. Rune Mysteries complete. And there we have Priest and Peril complete. Next up is Shield of Arav. And quest complete. Right now we are heading to Veos, which will be how we start the Client of Corn quest. And hopefully after that we can do Queen of Thieves. Looking back, I totally had no reason to be doing this quest, or Queen of Thieves for that matter, because to be honest, they don't really add too much content. I can still get 100% Piscarilius favor without them, so yeah, I'm not sure why I did them. However, you'll see that they don't really matter too much. Uh, well, l you'll just see. Keep watching. Are you serious? All right, please don't burn. There we are. Hello, my fellow pirate. Murder time. Um, hmm. How does a pirate do it? Probably brutally. And there we go, boys. Quest complete. We have cleared Port Piscarilius. Awesome. 
All right, next up is Jungle Potion. But before we actually do that, we're gonna have to get a few things from Entrana. One, we need some vials to make some anti-poison potions because I'm not gonna have a repeat of last time and when we nearly died. And also, this is the only place that you can kill unicorns, so those are needed for the anti-poison as well. So hopefully we have enough vials to get us to level 5 air blower. So there's no weapons or armor allowed on Entrana, but will they allow me to bring wine? And they will! Wow. Oh, and would you look at that? We can actually buy a pestle and mortar here as well. Sick. And we'll get some Eye of Newts as well. That way we can use up all those guams that we have been getting from hill giants. I mean moss giants. And check it out. There's actually a couple plank spawns on this island as well. So that's one of the ways we'll be able to train construction later on down, down the road. I'm kind of curious, do these monks heal me like they do in Edgeville? Oh, they do! That is pretty sweet. I don't suppose there are any sinks in here. Or water sources. Nope. Looks like I'm gonna have to go above the surface. Alright, I know what we're gonna have to do. Go quickly up to Witch Haven real quick. Don't worry, this location is, in the sh is within bounds. I knew there was a reason I left this house part of it. Oh, look at that! That's so much XP. And now we can make anti-poisons. Problem is, I only have one Marantil. Alright, I definitely am gonna need some Marantils, but unfortunately I only had one in the bank. Luckily, we do have three seeds in the bank, but unfortunately we need 14 farming. Unfortunately, the only place we have access to is Brimhaven, or sorry, Catherby, and that's going to require a 900 GP deposit, which we have right now, and I'll be stuck there for a while, and I'm still, I think I'm going to go do some more moss giants. Oh, yes! First ran our seed. Nice. That will come in handy for some prayer potions later. Oh, I just got a magic staff. Hell yeah. I think that's the last unique thing from Mosh Giants that we really kind of need besides like, you know, seeds and herbs. Awesome. 40 range. <clears throat> 40 range. Here's the loot from another trip of Mosh Giants. I just sold one of these. Um, we're going to sell it and see how much we get. Alright, I'm keeping the rest of this stuff and we are walking out of that trip with 6.6k and a ton of loot. And here's another trip of Mosh Giants. Okay, so we actually did get another Marantil from that last trip of Moss Giants. And, oh, and there's six Herbler. So, anyways, I think I'm gonna start Jungle Potion and get that out of the way. Oh, nice. 600 coins, I'll take it. And there's a kill. Steal Full Helm. I mean, it doesn't really matter because we can't really equip it. But yeah, I guess we can sell that for a little bit of GP. Second kill coins another steel full helm i'll take it there is a lot of armor that we could potentially get from lesser demons that would upgrade like we got like adamant plate body mithril chain body mithril square shield mithril axe adamant chain body you know lots of good stuff so if we can just get a little bit lucky of course if we got the rune med helm that would be super sick because, I mean, we can't wear it, but could just sell it to the shop for like 10k, and that would speed things up a lot. I don't know, we'll see what we can get. Coins. Steel Axe. I'm not sure if I already have that, but if I don't, that's pretty sweet. And coins again. Alright, I think it is time to head to Catherby. Um, I only have two anti-poison potions. Uh, I just want to play it safe because if I get caught with that poison in the Karamja jungle... Oh, not good, man. Not good. I am... Oh, sweet. So we actually do not have any other axes, so we just got an upgrade. Steel axe. Hold up. Before I sell, should probably keep the iron one. It's probably a good idea. 
There we go, 400 coins. Easy. That just paid for my trip. Hmm, what does this guy sell right here? Is this like the poison dude? Nothing, okay. All right, we have our rake and it is time to get some farming levels. We are currently sitting at a zero total XP. I think this is gonna take a while. There we go. I think while I'm raking the leaves, I'm gonna buy some pineapples just to make some super compost in the meantime. All right, so that is starting to compose and so hopefully in 90 minutes we'll have some super compost and that should help a lot with the farming. Next time on King of the Pirates.